Alright guys, well we made it. Day 200 on Fallout Survival Mode. This is probably the farthest I've ever gone before. Uh, last time when I made the video 100 days, I was at level 40. I'm now level 68. By the way, my name is Latin for Catfish. It's hired by the uh, Roach King in Fallout 3. Like Fallout 4 and 3 as well. But yeah, just an update video. Just to like uh, document everything. Again, now I'm not sure if we're going to be making it to, uh, you know, one year survival mode. It's getting a little bit harder because of like the more I progress in the game, the glitchy it gets. And I haven't even started the main quest line yet. I mean, I've been doing just side quests. Let me uh, bring it up here. So yeah, Diamond City Blues we're going to do right now. I'm, I'm, I'm seeing the armor ready for that. Uh, this will be the last thing I do. Main quest, uh, faction quest, this course is bugged. DLC, DLC. I will be doing this as the first DLC because it's the easiest one. And it shouldn't harm my game too much, I don't hope. Of course, more DLC, uh, faction. And then we'll uh, pick up a new one, Pigs Fly, just to like wrap things up. And unfortunately, I screwed up this quest. It's glitched now. I have to download the mod to fix this, but I forgot to do the radio signal at the beginning of the game. Unfortunately, so. Yeah, and Giddy Up, I gotta, <laughs> we gotta see as well. And the Rubia one is also bugged as well. But I think this is all that's left. I'm sure I've missed one or two, a few, a few probably. But I'll, I'll just go through like um, everything. But all right, if you want a breakdown of my build and stuff, uh, the cool thing is that I actually uh, got. So the way I built this um, build, as you see here, plus all the bobbleheads were needed. I did use one level to give myself nine luck, and we've started working. On, well, actually, uh, two luck, actually. I'm sorry. Two luck, and then we're working on four leaf and grim sprint or sprint. After that, I want to do endurance so we can do the Far Harbor DLC. For Nuka Cola, I really want Local Leader 2 and High Charisma. I my life a little easier on that one. Also, it's going to evolve. I also, need, I also need a lot of strength as well, so I'm probably not going to do that until I'm known the 100s. It's kind of unfortunate. I just... I'm sort of just waiting around to get supplies and stuff. I'm working on my armor. Uh, I mean, I, I have a shielded one, and I have one near the Glowing Sea, nearing uh, Somerville. I think it should, it should still be on my map, right? It's not, it's not showing Right, we have it all fixed up here. Should be four, but whatever. And we need to grab the last book. I I'm still like doing books and stuff. Bobbleheads are pretty much well, except for the the uh, locked main quest ones. But you know what it is? It's it's one of those like maintenance days where you have to just like. Where is he? Oh my god. <laughs> And another glitch I deal with is the game crashing and then this guy disappearing on me all the time. Let me just drop this stuff up here. I need aluminum and like copper and stuff to finish building this. We have the jetpack ready, but I have to like upgrade this to six. It's gonna take me a while, honestly. So I'm definitely gonna spend the next two weeks just hanging out, hanging out here, just buying stuff, going back and forth. I have plenty of like charisma items I can use to help out with that. But I also need a mod to fix the game cartridges here as well. Got the mods over there. I haven't used it yet though. Of course, my Slum Joe's here. Maybe a little special cos cosmetics I've been working on. But yeah, we're on the same build. Um, I did switch up to this gun now. It's kind of okay. You notice that he is carrying my eye. Um, I'm going for the old catfish theme, so I like change the name and stuff. Like, you know, very lofty. But. Yeah. Um, I hope to make a video of one year. I. It's good. And I, I progressed a lot in just 100 days, honestly. But with, with quests drying up now, I'm going to be relying more on, like, the, the faction ones. 
And that, and the problem with the DLC is I need certain perks and stuff. Yeah, that power armor, I'm going to give it to Hancock to bring it over to the castle, which I'll then use to go to the, the lucky thing. But for now, we have to like uh, get our hands on some copper, aluminum. Again, I did think about getting local leader, because then local leader 2, I would be able to like... You know, make stores and stuff, and just sit back and just make like become a millionaire in just, just a week or so. I mean, again, I don't go for aesthetics. I just I just put the the merchants right there next to the workbench, and then I just like sell them the water and just make a killing. Makes life easier. But yeah, it definitely makes more like preserved mash. So I have to like take a few each, but. I'm making this video now because there's going to be a lot of, like, you know, building stuff, waiting for merchants to restock stuff. Although, the constant crashes is why I'm, I'm not sure if I can make it to, like, I know if I start the, if I start the DLCs, this game is going to get a lot worse with glitches. I mean, Fallout 3 was the same way. Like, when I completed the DLCs, the game was just horrific. And, and, and you see the same problems in Fallout 4 as you saw in Fallout 3. But. Still here till there. Uh, the Enclave are an annoyance as well. There she is. Where are you? Like, I never, like. like I, I always miss her, you know? Never mind an important job or something. At least these three are here, so I can like make some money. My funds are low. Yeah. Hey, Carla. Back again. Time to do business. Sure. I hate Let's the talk. Let's just hurry it up, like, because enemies can attack us. The world is still moving around. That was a fail, but um, oh, that's it. Yeah. My son, I gotta check my purifiers. Or I haven't built one in a long time. I've just been using the materials. Right, we need it for material as well, but let me see. I'll grab the topper from her. That would be nice. And then we need nuclear material. So. Uh, I know, the most riveting content. I still got to figure out how I'm going to do the, um, the giddy up armor one, because that one is really, really tough. That's one of, like, one of the harder missions to do. How much water can I give her? Perfect. Works out for me. Thanks for <coughs> helping us out with Trudy. You did. I've got Lord. a few minutes to browse. The I same you. dialogue. It, it just just kills you. you know? <laughs> Again, if it wasn't apparent, I, I think Fallout Four is my favorite game of all time. Like no. Doubt I got about a that. To run here. You gonna buy? Let's see what you got. It's all but, man, it could have been. It could have been so much more. I, I do. I do need to learn how to make mods, though. That way, I can just like find out things. Okay. Um, I just bought from her recently, so she's not gonna have much stuff that I need. But she will have the copper, so I will take that. We're good with copper for a while. to carry some stuff because I'm heavy. This is why I want, I want to work on strength so badly. And, oh, why, why do I have this? Uh, oh, wow, I have, I have some useless stuff. Okay, that will explain. Uh, let's just save all the water as well. Okay. Oh my god. Alright, so we got some nuclear material. I'm always cautious in these areas because... I actually almost died recently because, like, well, I didn't really die. It's just that, like, I was turning a corner that I thought was safe. And, you know, the, that's the thing about these, like, spawn areas. Like, we all know this area is a spawn area. Like, I haven't seen anything in a while, but then all of a sudden something will appear. Like, you never know when it will deactivate and reactivate because spawn areas can reactivate, which I learned, like, just like an hour ago. <laughs> Lucky for me, it was it was just like three regular super mutants, but like, what what if it was there was a suicide or something, you know? Because I I got comfortable in a certain area, because 
the area over there near the, the Moonlight, the theater one, the Moonlight Drive-In, um, that spawn no longer is deactivated. It's just a raider that pops up now, which kind of sucks because, like, you can't really farm for legendaries anymore. You know, if, if I ever do this again in the future, which will be in a while, I'm, like, you know, I was telling myself I was going to do it when the PS5 5 Pro came out, but I'll probably wait for, like, a remaster or something to try this challenge again because, man, it's, it's a real toll on you. Now it's kind of fun and easy because I have all the perks I need and everything is going well, but... Oh, here we go. I got my dog ready. Rex. And Cock is here because I'm going to transfer him to the cow. So I, I already said that, but I'm, I'm going to give him the armor to take it for me. Like, I want to have an armor at like, like a lot of the major settlements, which I have, I have a ton of them anyway. I do need to grab the one at the. Um, the devil mission. I didn't grab that one because I was like, because I knew the mo the the mole rats were there. Oh shit! That's took a while. Oh my god! I know dogs can't die, but still, like, I'm still used like the old fallouts when they can. That's it. Unless they can. That's actually a very rare item. I will take it. Thank you very much. And anyway, we're gonna head back here. I'm, I'm gonna end the video. I just wanna like do a little like, quick thing. Uh, I tie myself from here to Som Somerville. And by the way, I, I butcher these names consistently. It's it's a summon near near the um not, not the summon. What am I saying? But it's the summon near the glowing sea. I do, I do have armor there, and I have a shielded one that I have at the Warwicks, which I, I told Prescott to go to. But I want to have one at the castle as well, because there's a lot, of, a lot of missions there, concentrated there as well. Uh, see, when I increase my weight, I'll be able to, like, again, this is why I need the DLCs to get, get the ammo for some of these more unique guns. Get everything here. Yeah, that's that. Um, yeah, we, I'm, I'm gonna start building, I'm just you know, waiting for Carla in the future and stuff. Cause I'll probably be here for like a week, just so I can like you know, get the armor ready for the, for the future jobs and whatnot. Like, I may as well just head back down there as well with this one, cause it's gonna be really, really sweet. I'm gonna give it like the the devil mod and stuff. The jetpack, like this is gonna be very, very sweet. Again, the Enclave mission at first I hated it, but like you can see, like there's a lot of lot of good things about it. I gotta do his armor as well. I'm like really behind and stuff. Like, you know, I got more over here. I gotta I, there's something I leave behind as well, which I should grab. Got one at the uh, marina. I actually sent the mercenaries from that quest, uh, the Linwood one over there, the good fighter fighters. There's a, a very basic T45 there. I need to, like, you know, take the armor, go over there, swap it out, and get that ready as well. So, a lot of maintenance in the coming days. That's why I wanted to do this quick video. Hey anyway, guys, if you enjoyed, uh, take care. Thanks for watching till the end. I love you all.